case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 2009, a major case in Reed Journal Register Company transpired before the United States Bankruptcy Court for the Southern District of New York. The Journal Register Company, along with its affiliates, found themselves in financial turmoil when they defaulted on their loans. Unable to repay creditors, they applied for bankruptcy under Chapter 11 of the Bankruptcy Code. This bankruptcy filing saw the Journal Register Company proposing a scheme aimed at converting its secured debts into equity, paying off a portion of their unsecured debts, eliminating old stock holdings, and instituting a bonus plan for key employees. Precursory negotiations between the Journal Register Company and J.P. Morgan Chase Bank had resulted in an amendment to the plan, garnering the support of key entities, including the secured lenders and the creditors' committee. However, this plan was not without detractors, especially central states, who, being part of the creditors' committee, objected strenuously to the plan. Their argument was underpinned by the belief that the proposal was biased, unfairly discriminating against some unsecured creditors. The defenses put forward by both the Journal Register Company and the Guild, Central States, and Connecticut were consequently dismissed by the court. It deemed these objections irrelevant to the case at hand and confirmed the debtor's plan. In its final ruling, the court substantiated the constitutional propriety of the debtor's plan. The court cited compliance with the bankruptcy code as the primary reason for its decision and in doing so, made a significant precedent regarding bankruptcy cases in the United States. The ruling underscored that any restructuring plan proposed in light of bankruptcy must be in the best interest of the company and its creditors and maintain adherence to federal code. Following this ruling, any arguments relating to variations were dispelled and the Guild's concerns were dismissed. Ultimately, this confirmed that while companies may face financial adversity, Adherence to the specific guidelines of the bankruptcy code would always be stringently weighed and upheld in court. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.